In this video, we're going to take a look at how we can create black and white and sepia tone photos in Lightroom Mobile. Let's get started. I open up Adobe Lightroom and I choose my photograph. From here, I am going to come to color. At the top of the color, I see the option for black and white. I click B and W. Now I want to come and adjust the distribution of light across this image. I am going to lighten my whites and darken my blacks to create more contrast across this image. I want to get a sense of what it looked like before I did this. I can click undo and then I can click redo to get a sense of how it looked before the change. This will go through the history of this edit. I can continue to work with my blacks and whites until I find an image that I like. In the top of the light panel, we can also click the curves. This will give us a graph with the line across it. We can use our curves to set the black and the white points. I can click to add other points. I want to make sure that when I click the curves that I have selected the color wheel with all of the colors. This will target the distribution of value across all channels of our image. I can also try and click one of the colors. And now when I start to change the colors, I can see because I'm on the blue channel that it has this blue cast to the image. I can click on to the red channel and I can see I have these reds. This makes it feel like it has a sepia tone. This is a great way to create a photograph with a sepia tone effect. Black and white photography has endless possibilities.